Hey everyone, we're gonna do a video today on how to rotate in Canva. Now, I'm gonna cover a lot of different things and how you can rotate a page in Canva, an image, an element, how you can rotate images within a frame, how you can rotate and flip individual elements, etc. So let's dive into it. The first one is how to rotate a page in Canva. Now, you technically can't rotate a page in Canva, even in Canva Pro. What you can do is you can change the orientation of a page. And I have a separate video on it if you would like to see that. The link is in the description below. But here I will just quickly cover it of how you can change the orientation or you can change the, you can rotate the page in Canva. So what you do is you have to go to resize and magic switch. Now this is available only in Canva Pro. So you go to custom size. And once you select, you have to click on here within the within the numbers. Then you will see this video. Then you will see this pop up. So this is in landscape right now. You can make it portrait. You can make it square, or you can simply choose a different um, dimension. Like I want to do it, say eight hundred by one thousand. So it is orient. So it is changing the orientation. It is changing the rotation. But, or I can also make it 850 and we see the other size. And, but it will still make it a portrait. So, and then you select the page that you need because we don't need all of them. Click, click. And then if I continue and then I copy and resize, now it's going to open it for me in a different page. I can also choose to exist, to rotate this existing page, but I cannot do that for only one page here. So that's how you change the orientation. You change the rotation and you move it to a different uh, design. If you just simply want to take all of these elements and rotate it to the left, the best way to do is group it. Then click on this handlebar here and just turn it left. Correct. There you go. Right? That's the easiest way to just simply rotate the elements in, in the direction you want. You can just do it like this. Of course, for text, it doesn't make sense. But if you just have in one image or one element, you can just play around with it. So I'm just going to undo all of that. And then I'm going to ungroup it. So that's how you would take the elements in the page and just rotate them. But if you want to change the rotation of the whole page and make it a portrait, for example, then you can open it in a different direction and give it custom dimensions. Now, how do you rotate an image? So here you go. Let's say I've taken this image. You can again click on this one and you can move it in whichever direction you want. Keep in mind that if you press shift and do this, because I used to do that because of my habit with Photoshop or Illustrator, but that's not required in Canva, because if you press shift, then it will want to scale the image as you move it. Okay, so it's see, it's it's I'm just pressing shift and I'm making it small and I'm just rotating in different directions, but the sizes are adjusting. I'm not doing anything, right? So make sure you don't press shift. You just move this and then your size does not change. Okay, the other way to do it, if you want a specific angle, like you want a 90 degrees and you don't think you have control with this, you just go to position and then you do a custom dimension here, a rotation here. So say 90 degrees. And if you go, I think you can do minus 90 and it goes the other way. So that's how you would rotate an image. Similarly, with an element. Um, so let's take, for example, not in scale, but let's take any element. Graphics, uh, graphics here. For example, I take this element, right? Similarly, if I want to move it, I can do it like that or go to position and give the angle here and it will rotate. That's how you rotate images and elements in Canva. Now, how about if you want to rotate an image within a frame, like this is a custom frame here, and there are the images inside, the, it's the same logic as the previous ones. You just have to double click 
So now, because right now, your, your frame is selected. To s you have to select the image if you want to turn the image. So you can s click here, then you get your same handlebar and you can rotate it. Here I'm not pressing shift, but it's still scaling. So just watch out for that. And that's how. So now if I let it go, for example, there. But I don't want that, so I'm going to get back here. So that's how you rotate an image within a frame. So you just click on the frame, double click it, select the image, and then move it. In this option, you don't have the position highlighted. So you will just have to do it manually, or you can probably try here, but it does not work the same way. So For example, if you do it 90, I think it scales it a little bit. So you might have the most luck just clicking the, bo the button here and moving it like that. So that's how you rotate an image within a frame in Canva. The last one I want to cover is how to flip elements in Canva. Now, you, I again have a different video on this, but just to add it in here as well. So if you want to flip an element or an image, you just click on flip and you do flip horizontal or flip vertical. And that's about it. You can do the same thing with an image. Flip horizontal, flip vertical. Right? So that's how you rotate in Canva. So we explored how to rotate a page in Canva or rather change the orientation, how to rotate an image, how to rotate an element, how to rotate an image within a frame and how to flip elements and images. And that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.